Here's how to make dark and white chocolate fondant with all. So firstly, we're gonna make the white chocolate ganache, which is going to be the gooey center. So firstly, we're gonna go in with 100 grams of white chocolate into a bowl. And to that, we're gonna add 100 ml of hot cream. Give that a good stir. So once that combines nicely and the chocolate has melted, we're gonna place that into the fridge to hard. So we're gonna go straight into the stand mixer with 80 grams of golden castor sugar. And to that, we're gonna add two eggs. Place this on to whisk until it becomes pale and fluffy. We're gonna to mix together 110 grams of butter and 110 grams of dark chocolate. And we're just going to melt these in the microwave. It's gonna switch it off and we're gonna add in that melted chocolate and butter to the mixture. And to that, we're gonna add 60 grams of the new Odlum's Cream Plain Super Flour. Give this another whisk to combine everything together. Add the mixture then into a piping bag. And this can be stored then in the fridge until you're ready to use it. Okay, so you can line a couple of different types of molds for this. So I've just lined a ceramic bowl with a little bit of butter and cocoa powder. Or you can do a pastry ring with some parchment paper and butter as well. Pipe the fondant mixture in about halfway and then the same then with the other mold. So make a little groove with a spoon for the ganache. So just pipe in then a small bit of that white chocolate canine and just finish then by piping then on top. Place these into the oven at 200 degrees and cook for 12 minutes. And there you have it, the most delicious dark and white chocolate fondant with olives.